Why, hello there, gorgeous. Hey there, guys. Boney McBonerton here, and welcome back to... It's locked for a reason. Don't get any ideas. You don't get any ideas, Wasteland Wench. And in this episode, we are going to be uh, dicking around in Dave's Republic. But first... Let's see, 12, 1, 2... Okay, so that's 12. And I'm pretty sure I just heard thunder outside. That is not a good sign. No, it's not. Alright, let's get up. Ugh. Uh, another foreigner in the Republic. Shut up. Come on, make it fast. I got chores. <laughs> Look at this fucking nerd. He has to do chores. I'd like to discuss the election with you. Oh yeah? What about it? Have you can... Have you concern um, you're running presidency? Man, I'd love to be the president. Everybody would have to listen to me or I could just exile them to the wasteland. Uh, I and the first thing I'd do is make myself the permanent leader so they couldn't vote me out in some other election. But there's no need for me to run. One year, Dave is just going to make me the leader, just like my grandpa Tom did for him. Uh, <laughs> you're too young to take Dave's place anyway. Too young. Too young! I am so sick of everyone around here pulling that you're too young crap with me. I'm tired of it. I'm old enough to take Dave's place. I'll win that election and show everybody. Later, Bob. Just don't bother me. I've got stuff to do for Dave. Yeah, he is definitely not president material. Hell, I'd kill him right now except for the fact the Brahmin are watching. Oh, that's not a person. Welcome to the Museum of Dave. Hello. A oh. oh. Like in the stories about Dave. You're tiny. You're t you're fucking Look look how tiny she is. Hey there. Are you going to play Republic with us? Later. I must discuss. So, Dave gave you the okay, huh? Well, welcome then. I run the Museum of Dave where the children of the Republic can learn about their heritage. I'd like to discuss the election with you. Me? I'm not sure if I can help you. You know, Bob is running for president. Hmm. I don't know that he stands much of a chance against Dave. Have you considered running for the presidency? Absolutely not. In fact, I'd vote for Dave twice if I could. I guess not. Anything else? Um, this guy Dave has his own museum? Oh yes, everything here is from Dave's adventures in the Wasteland before he founded the Republic. I give a tour every day starting around 2 p.m. You should stop by then. Alright, sure. I'll leave you to the kids. Come back and visit the museum anytime. Wait, I'm not allowed in here? I mean, wh wh why Why not? What? what why? Ooh, what's in here? Nah. Let's get class started. But I already know everything about Dave. So, who can tell me how Dave saved the people from the wrath of Tom? I thought Grandpa Tom just gave Dave the Republic. Oh, she's on to you, Good Shona. To you. you tricky little bitch, you. And I deeply emphasize on little. You're, you're downright tiny. Let's see what we can talk to you. There's Dave. Dickweed Dave. There's you, Jessica. Dave says you're okay? Fine. I'd like to discuss the election with you. I'll help you if I can. Have you considered running for presidency? No way. You'd have to be crazy to run against him. Hmm. 
Um, did Dave say you could do that? No, but I'd like to. Anything else? Uh... See you, Jessica. You're safe as long as Dave says so. I don't fucking like the, uh... Hey, Morning. Rosie. I heard that Dave allowed you to stay. Well, welcome, stranger. Just be mindful of the children. What do I look like to you people? Jared from Subway? Come on. I'd like to discuss the election with you, though. Election time is always exciting around here. Have you considered running for presidency? Believe it or not, I used to lead a group bigger than this one on an old caravan route. I did it for years, and we did pretty well for ourselves. But what am I talking about? Running against Dave would be like betraying him. You could lead the Republic into a new era. The democracy of Rosie! You're right. Dave's just been pushing me around. It's time for a change. You should go vote if you haven't already. You're right. I'll go right now. Hey, you. Dave says you're okay? Fine. You should go vote if you haven't already. I guess you're right. I'll go right now. But if Dave get No, no, no. Hey, hey, hey. Sharon, Sharon, Fingers Sharon. Fingers crossed. Sharon. Sharon. Listen, listen. Don't All don't done. don't look away from me. Sharon, come here. Come here. Come here. Over here. Come on. Listen, we gotta talk, buddy. Be listen. cautious. Bob cannot get elected. If, if, if he gets elected, he'll literally turn this place into a, a tyrannical dictatorship. If he gets elected, we we gotta execute him, Bob. We gotta execute Bob. Anyone in the women's quarters? No. I'm amazed they all just don't sleep with Dave's. Yo, Bobby boy. Come on, make it fast. I got chores. You should go vote if you haven't already. Fine, I'll get out of the way. So let's see, do the map get that one for someone. So she can convince us to go to vote. Hello, something you need? Let's see, uh... I'd like to discuss the election with you. Me? I'm not sure if I can help you. Have you heard that both Bob and Rosie are running in the election? Wow. This is the first time we've had so many choices. I know, right? I'd like to ask you something else. Anything else? You should go vote if you haven't already. Oh no. Dave sent you to tell me that, didn't he? I'll go right away, I promise. No, oh, don't, don't. Take your time. You're fine. Let's go see how the election goes. Alright, now time to spy. Sharon, you're in fucking power armor. You're not exactly stealthy here. Aw, you even sit down when you're... Oh, yeah, that's, that's cute. Move out of the way, dog meat. I'm gonna win this. Yes, that's locked. And yes, I can see you eyeing it. Shut up. Go vote. Hello. Ah, Dave, lead our republic to glory. Okay, did everyone vote? You, did you hey vote? There. Did you vote? Dave says you're okay? Fine. Did you vote? You should go vote if you haven't already. I went and voted. Good. Good. See you later. Bye. Did you vote? Tommy, I you heard voted. that Dave allowed you to stay. Well? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You should go vote if you haven't already. Already did my part. Good. Good, good, good. Time for him to go. Now, Dave! Out with it, Ambassador. This Republic isn't going to run itself. I'd like to discuss the election. The more. election is still going on. What do you want to know? Uh, looks like all the votes are in, Mr. President. Good. The votes are in. If you'll excuse me, I'll be getting started on tallying the numbers. Oh yes, I almost forgot. Here's your caps. Keep this up and I may deign to make you a citizen in a few years. A few. Oh, 25? Oh, fuck you, baby. Yeah, it's it's just Dave. 
You have my vote, Mr. President. I Wait. can't believe it's only a couple of days away. Wait, ch children can vote? Are you really from the wasteland? Wow! Yes? What can President Dave do for you? Hmm. Tell me more about your republic, Mr. President. The Department of Tourism usually handles all questions for outsiders. Make it quick. Hmm. I'd be interested in learning about you more, Mr. President. Years ago, I freed these poor people from the wrath of Tom, former monarch of the Kingdom of Tom. Afterwards, the people naturally elected me as their president and the Republic of Dave was formed. Any future p plans for the Republic, Mr. President? Well, the Republic of Dave is the only true sovereign nation in the Wasteland. The only really civilized place left in the world. One day, all Wastelanders will be citizens in the Republic and know the greatness of their president. Mm, all right. So, that's all I need to know. Well, good for you, then. Yes, it is. I have to go now. Very well. Let's see what we have here. Bye. Be careful. Don't worry, I won't steal. What's the verdict? Yes? What? Nothing? Okay. Very well. Let's come back in a few days, see what happens. Hey there. Hey. But now, we have all the keys we'd ever need. Ford Constant. Let's see what this is. Go back to uh, Paradise Falls. High Charisma gives bonuses to both the Bada and Speech Skill. It truly does. But no. Despite what the quest says, you are not supposed to give the keys to Mr. Crowley at all. Thought I heard lasers for a second there. I think I might have. Over here. Oh shit, I did! Good shot. Ooh. Nice. I wonder what they killed. Bitch. What the fuck? Sharon, what'd you do? Seriously, Sharon, I appreciate you helping me, but goddamn, be careful where you point that fucking thing. That could have been us getting mulched in that car explosion. And I don't want that to happen again. It's an insect, I can tell by the weird noises. It's an ant, I knew it. Where 
Oh god. Okay, there's a lot of them, but no need to worry. fun fact about the mysterious stranger oh god we're full hold on gotta eat eight million ant legs okay good enough very fun fact about the mysterious stranger there are actually a few glitches or exploits you could perform to kill the mysterious stranger while you're in VATS mode. Over here. Oh, for God's sakes, I can't do anything without getting interrupted. And if you do manage to kill him, you can get a weapon called the Mysterious Magnum, which is a 44 Magnum without the scope, and it deals infinite damage in the game like you can literally kill a super mutant behemoth in one shot you can kill everything in one shot except for liber yeah i'm not gonna say his name oh come on why do i keep running in you know what you know what Sit down, bud. Holy shit, he's actually sitting down. Impressive. Ugh, give me a kiss. Oh god, never mind. Hold on, let me just finish the job. Yeah, I did it. Another one? Hey, boo boo! How do you like this picnic basket? You fucking ate that thing now. Oh, fuck's sakes. Oh, I can hear their groans and it's gross. No, you stop that. <laughs> Fuck him up! Also, let me demonstrate how this weapon has a much higher fire rate than the other hunting rifles. That's what makes it so unique, because it's literally just constantly popping off shots. It's nice. scared there would have been a Yaogwai in here. God damn, quite down, dog meat. Shh. Sharon. I don't like the look of this place. Here, let's trade equipment, alright? Very well. Because why not? And I'll give you the leather belt, medical brace, all this fun stuff. Okay, how how's that sound? Sound good? I like it. Yes. Mm 
There you go. Let's go. And I shall follow. Let's stay away from there. I can see uh, hanging bodies off of that, and I know there are readers over there. And I do not have time to do that now. Let's start it, fuck boy! Yeah, the fuck. Oh my god! <laughs> he went flying! Oh, come on! Get fucked. Let's see, you flew off over here, so... Oh, that's Traitor and... Uh, what the fuck is that doing up there? Yeah. Hey. If you're not you... involved with this, you want to keep it that way. You know, I'm you're not involved in this. What the fuck did you guys do? You know what? I'm a cheap bastard. I'm just gonna... Ugh. But seriously... What the fuck did you guys do? No time to talk to your type, local. Why don't you go bother the Brotherhood or something? Hey, what'd you do? No time to talk to your type, local. I'm sick of your shit! I know you did something bad! You're, going to pay for that. You're next! I know it! Get Nene! Oh, what the? Oh, hello. Where does body go? Oh, here it is. Okay, let's go. Hi there. Hey there. Oh, you're a guy. You're a girl. You got anything for sale? Take a look. Welcome to Godforsaken Hellhole. Not much to look at, but it's all mine. <laughs> I don't think she's okay. Mm, not a lot I'm looking for. I don't know. I'll take the stim pack. Here, how about some this and this and there you go. A pleasure doing business with you. Nice voice, by the way, but I need to get going. Bye. Bye as well, youngin. Hmm, is this Fort Constantine? It appears so.
Oh, because of the robot? Don't worry, it's dead. What? Hmm, don't have full lock picking to get in there. What about this door? Also very hard. There are a lot of robots here. What the? Oh, hell no, you did not! No, I gotta walk all the way back over here, you fuck boy! God damn it! Ugh. Oh, what the? It's just gone! Oh, that, that's gross. Oh. Aw, uh, now I can't sell the power armor! Okay, we are back. Now then, instead of going that way and having our game crash, we're gonna go this way. Yay! What the? That's it. That's it. Oh! Sorry, bitch. Oh, no, 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 not that way. That way's death. Ugh, that fucking sucked. I had to- I didn't have to walk as far, but I still had to go back and, um, kill those guys because, you know, bad people. But I can tell because they gave off their fingers. Why did that explode? Oh, that's weird. There you go. Personal offices? Uh, nah. Not yet. Ugh. Hey, look. Thrusters glitched out and they're still going. Don't know why it felt like it had to fight a... Protectron, though. I won't lie, that's weird. <laughs> what is it? Oh. Dude, that's just Sharon. And yeah, I know for a dog- I know you're a dog and he smells delicious. But dude, don't eat Sharon, okay? He smells like he's made of beef jerky, but believe me, you don't want to eat that. Or do you? Because you know. Sorry, bitch. What the? Are you in the... Okay, no. Oh. I don't know, you tell me! You sexy brain in a jar, you! Oh god, this screaming is not doing any good for my voice. Kinda weird that there's a chalkboard, a belt, and a lunchbox in here. What kind of shit were you doing in here, man? Looks like Sharon found it. Why don't you just come out where I can see you? Because you'll shoot me in the dick. There, is that a good answer? Ah! Dog me, where are you? Oh, 
Okay, you know what? You guys have all the fun while I just do all the looting here. How'd you guys get here before I even did? Ugh. Oh. You. Ooh, gun cabinets. this no I don't need to hack it I'm fine what I will do is repair old painless sorry dog meat but it's dog eat dog world out there literally Hey, dog meat. Cure. Wait, you, you can't carry shit for me? Okay, fine. Ah, I still love you, though. Alright, let's go. Sharon, I need you to pack a mule some stuff for me. Yes, what is it? Straight equipment. Very well. Oh, come on. Okay. Ah, uh, fine, fine. I'll just drop some shit off. and cleaned up. A singular bottle cap in that big ass box. I know, right? Oh. Well, he was not having a good day. I'll take that off of you, too. You get get the fuck out of here. Oh well, I guess while I'm at it. <coughs> Delicious. <coughs> mm, good. Simply divine. Oh god. What's a feral ghoul doing out here? Yay! Alright, now, to the top of the building. Wait, did we search you? Yes, we did. Ah, the magnificent roof with the dead robot.
Yeah, there's... Oh, hello. Hey, what the hell? So let's see, if I can do this correctly, I'm slide down here. Oh no! <gasps> okay, I broke both my legs, but that's fine. That's why we have stim packs. Ooh, that hurt. There's no way out of this fence! Do we have to- oh my god, we have to go through the f fucking offices again. That's why I broke my legs, to avoid that! No wait, no, there's a gate here. Oh. I can just walk around the gate. I'm not a very wise man, I've said before. And that's okay. CEO headquarters. Commencing attack oh, fuck. on hostile. No. Where? Uh, okay. He's dead. Well, this seems like a very good stopping point. Nice, comfortable home. Skeleton of the CEO. Rattle me bones! <laughs> Away with you. I'm gonna pick the cherry bombs. Sounds like a looks like a really fun game he had between him and his robot. All right, Bony McBoneton with episode thirty, maybe. I I fucking can't remember. Have a good day now and goodbye.